In today's video, I'm gonna share with you the latest news that we have on the most anticipated camera of 2020, the Canon EOS R5. So here we are, it's another Canon announcement and it's a highly anticipated one on the Canon EOS R5. Now last month in March, they made an announcement telling us that this camera will have an 8K video, it will have 4K video of course, and it will have so many different features that many photographers have wished for from a Canon camera for many years, which is brilliant news. But just a day ago, yesterday, they also announced more features which they have confirmed and I wanna share those with you in today's video. So the things that we definitely know that the Canon EOS R5 will have, it will have 8K raw non-cropped internal recording. And this is gonna be at 30 frames per second, which is phenomenal. Now this is going to be for the full sensor width, the whole sensor, which is what well, is unparalleled in a camera of this kind of size and I'm sure for this kind of price point that it will be released. Now, of course, we don't know the price currently, but I'm sure the price will be somewhere between three and $5,000. Now, it's gonna also have a non-cropped internal recording, 8K video capture, and this is gonna be in 422 10-bit, and this will be in Canon C-Log, which is brilliant, which means that you'll be able to color grade this really impressive footage in 8 Okay, now that's if you can find a PC or a computer or laptop, which will actually take care of that for you. Good luck there. Also, you're gonna have the H265, which means it's gonna be a better compression, or you'll also get HDRPQ at H265 as well. Now you're gonna have non-cropped internal recording in 4K, and this is gonna be, wait for it, this is probably the most exciting feature about this camera for me, 120 frames per second. So that's four times the speed that you would normally have 4K at, which means you're gonna be able to get some Peter McKinnon buttery smooth style uh, impressive B-roll. Now this is something which I know a lot of videographers and video creators have wanted from the Canon cameras. And this is something which is definitely gonna be included and confirmed on the Canon EOS R5. Now you'll get this in 422 10-bit in also Canon C-Log and you'll also get that at H265, which is a better compression as well. Now you're gonna have 422 10-bit in Canon Log and 422 10-bit HDR PQ output via your HDMI. And you'll be able to get this at 4K up to 60 frames per second which I think is about as good as you can get it at the moment. Now both 8K and 4K video modes are going to include dual pixel autofocus. I'm sure a lot of you already know what that is uh, in Canon cameras, especially if you're a Canon user or a Canon owner, but it basically means that you can guarantee that your autofocus is going to be sharp and in focus most, if not all, of the time. So to know that you're gonna have that 8K available, that 4K at 120 frames per second available, Having dual pixel autofocus, which will guarantee you're in focus as well, it's gonna be pretty much unbeatable when it's released. That is, unless another camera manufacturer releases something close to this in the meantime. But with the climate and the economy the way it is at the moment, and with this horrible disease, which is kind of everywhere, I wouldn't imagine that many other camera manufacturers are gonna offer anything within this time frame. Now the next thing you're gonna get on this camera is five axis optical IBIS, in body image stabilization. Now this is something that Canon has been reluctant upon adding into their Canon cameras up until the Canon EOS R5. Now that combined with the RF lenses, which already have very impressive stabilization added in, then you're gonna be getting some really low shutter speeds that you'll be able to shoot at and you'll be able to still get really nice sharp images with. So I'm just so excited about this camera full stop. And uh, if I can get my hands on one when it first comes out, you can bet I'll be doing a review on it. Now, the final thing I wanna share with you in today's video, something that they've guaranteed, is it's definitely gonna have dual card slots. Now we thought this was gonna happen, but it's being guaranteed, it's here in front of me. Canon have said this, and you're gonna get one 
um, SD UHS 2 but the great news is you're also going to get a CF Express card so you're going to get that rapid write speed which is going to be almost instantaneous when you're firing off in burst shooting mode. So guys that is the information that we have from Canon on the EOS R5 currently. Now I'm sure that there might be other little teasers and updates which Canon share with us uh, in the meantime before this camera is released but I've got to be honest with you, what we know about this camera so far, I can't see how this is not going to be a world beater. And it's certainly going to put Canon in pole position when it comes to the best mirrorless camera of 2020. I want to thank you guys for watching today's video. Make sure you hit subscribe if you're new to the channel so you can see future updates and videos. And whatever you do for the rest of the day, guys, make sure it's a good one. And I'll see you in the next video.